it's Johanna here. Uh, look, nothing flash. Just gonna go out for some Jalangadi, some Goanna. Um, just another lazy day off, so thought I'd, thought I'd go out, go out for a squeeze, have a look. Uh, wish me luck. I'll keep you updated. Have some more video. Um, I brought the guns, so you know if one's a little bit too far and I'm feeling a little bit too slack, I'll just shoot it. Um, otherwise, we'll see if we can maybe pull one out of out of its hole. Chase one down um, with a stick. <laughs> See what happens. Just go with the flow, really. It's just kind of an unplanned go in a hunting day. Uh, just basically getting out of the house. Sick of looking at the four walls and Netflix. Uh, we'll see how we go. All right. Wish me luck. See, there's a bit of rain over there. So basically just driving around um, looking for goanna out in the in the open areas here um, also looking for their holes or a hole in the in these ant hills um, hopefully we can see see goanna inside one of those holes I, <laughs> I just saw a hole at a um, at an anthill or termite man whatever we're calling them um, the first anthill I saw actually had a had a hole in it and I checked it and it had a big king brown there so that's not a it's not a good start um, but that's okay I'll, I'll keep on looking around I, I won't disturb that king brown it was already gone in a bit too far to get some footage but um, I'm sure you'll take my word for it all right I'll keep looking so I just drove past this little hole here you can see some fresh dirt or freshly disturbed dirt that's normally a sign of goanna Yeah, so this here is a, it's obviously a little guy in a hole in there. You can see some freshly disturbed dirt, sand. Uh, you can even see the tail tracks here. So you know there's a guy in there. I mean, pretty pretty likely to be in there. You can see the little paw print there. Um, but it's a pretty small hole. Well, we'll have a look. Oh, we've got some thunder happening. I should be all right. <coughs> You can see the hole goes that way. See how I've cut that dirt, but you can see that that isn't straight there. So. This one's gonna be a little one, if he's in here. Or she. Oh, there he is. She is. See that? He's actually digging in, starting to dig in a bit more. That's a little one. Usually when you're driving around in the grass like this, um, the goannas can, even like when they're not alert of you, they can just be sta standing on all fours and you won't see them in the grass. Um, <clears throat> so if you meet the horn, sometimes they'll stand up to have a look at, to have a look at what that noise was. Um, so y'all yeah, be doing that throughout the day. If you, if you see me beeping around, <laughs> that's what it is. <laughs> So yeah, after you beep the horn, you, you, you look for um, look for the goannas that might stand up in the grass. So you're taking a bit of a gamble, you know, the, the goannas could stand up and have a look at what the noise is, or they could say, nah, I don't like the sound of that, and, and just run off. Um, but that's, that's just hunting, isn't it? 
I'm actually in an area that I haven't really been looking around in before. Um, the area as a, as a whole I've, I've, I've been to, but this this one little spot that I'm at now is, is a bit new to me. Um, so I've got to be careful, you know, look out for stumps so I don't get flat tires. Um, make sure I remember the way back, things like that. Um, like I said, I saw a goanna back in a hole, uh, sorry, a, a king brown back in a hole back there. Uh, an, ant, an ant's nest. That's just something you don't want to see or encounter when you're on your own like this. Um, so yeah, I just got to be really careful being out here on my own. You know, I've got plenty of water and things like that, but still got to account for plenty of different variables. <laughs> um, yeah, there's plenty of risk out here, plenty of danger out here. Um, but it's a pretty, you know, a lot of, a lot of people come hunting out on Yarrow country um, so if something happens to you you know early enough in the day like this hopefully someone else comes across comes around um, but you always got to remember to you know remember your way back to back to the highway or back to the road um, don't get don't get too don't go too wild you know backtracking and things like that people think about shortcuts when they get stuck and just cut through the bush you can you can it's, it's, it's very easy to lose your direction um, and you know, you can get lost. You know, to be honest, on a, on a big cloudy day last year, about this time actually, I, I, was, I, I lost my direction um, walking through the bush looking for goanna. Um, yeah, it's the last time I did that. It was a bit of a wake up call. You know, you think you know, think you know your country pretty well. You think you think you know your directions, um, things like that. But one slight little a slight little variable can can throw you off and that's all it takes
For those that don't know, it's goanna. Oh, goanna, yeah. But it tastes like chicken. <laughs> Do you think you need more garlic or not? It's all good. Mabu mate. <laughs> 